Welcome to Comet Man Cocktails. It's I'm hard. your host, Derek Schomer. It's and I've so got hard. Like Doug I Peterson here. I'm hard. Hi, Doug. <laughs> Not hard. <laughs> Not anymore. Yeah. Not no after that cares. flaccid T intro. TMI. Yeah! Let's go! This is what we're doing today. We're going to do the fireside fling. This recipe was not submitted by anybody. I went and I found it on Liber's website. So. Why? Because you wanted to use crab oil? Yeah. No, it's not crab oil! <laughs> it's Texas grapefruit. This is a different one. Yeah. So. Yeah. Oh, by the way, they're different. $13 each if I, if I carry them, which I probably will because they're interesting. Yeah. Um, the Paradisi was the one I was going to do, mm -hmm. but I changed up. Paradisi. So after our last episode where we used the Hendrix Gin and whatever, they wrote back today and was like, "That's true. I we agree that you should use a a less um, flavorful washed, gin." They watched the show. I sent it to them. Hell yeah. Um, <laughs> I sent, dude. This is this what I do. People are like, how do you get all this like information and fans and, and products? Because I, I'm proactive. Oh, right? So I said, right. here's the episode. This is our thoughts. I'm still, you know, talking about carrying the product. Mm -hmm. And they said, use a more London dry gin without the cr crazy notes. Mm -hmm. It'll probably work better. For yeah, me. because Which, we were saying that the the cucumber was of the Hendrix gone. was like... Pfft. Right. Yeah. So this one's going to be a grapefruit shrub. You know what a shrub is? Yeah, it's about yay big. <laughs> and then, you know, you trim it back. Shrubbery! Yeah. Well, <laughs> women have... Right, no, I'm talking men about... Men have shrub free, too. Shrubs. Not if you manscape. But, you know, it's mostly in the thing of talking about women shrubbery. You know, Do you know what a shrub means in, in case of, like, say, what we're talking about here with a grapefruit shrub? It's like a... Uh, a bush that grows like a grapefruit. It's like a no, it's nothing to do with a tree. It's it's like a blend of stuff. I can't remember what it is. God damn it. <laughs> well, why'd you bring what? it up? Because I was, was hoping foolish. you were gonna. Because <laughs> Doug is usually like, yeah, that's a such and such and such and such. Not tonight. He's all I about. I did it. It was. Yeah. Pubic hair. He's no, all about sex obviously. tonight. No, it's not pubic hair. Did I use that whiskey already? It's a pure yes expression of grapefruit. Three quarters out. So what we're doing here is citrus, citrus, even the chat room said a shrubbery. Coconut. Somebody Google it for me. God. So we're gonna do an ounce Three of scotch. Shrubs, shrubs deliver bright. Where's my top? You already did it. No, I know. I'm looking for the top, so I didn't spill it. Oh, give me that. So we're using for our scotch. We're using a blended. It's called Great King Street. This is something that um, Curtis had left here. <laughs> Neat. Neat. And. We got a French vermouth. We got our herring cherry liqueur. What are you doing? Are you just drinking it? Is it herring yeah. or herring? Herring, herring, herring. I don't know. Herring or herring? Question today. Herring. Um, herring. Herring. Three quarters of an ounce of grapefruit shrub. Did anybody answer what shrub is yet? No. Knee. No! <laughs> we are the knights who say icky, That's what icky. people have around there generally. But there. Maybe a small decorative fence. Oh my gosh. You people are no help! <laughs> you silly English canagrips. It's a canagrips. It's like a lot of high fives. Somebody's like, wow, you're pretty. You must have muscles to do that. No, I just move my hand. Like that. Your arm. Hey, not next week, but the week after. You don't have to come down. He's not going to be here. Oh, you're right. He doesn't. No, he probably will. We should probably huh? talk about the 38. We have to do 30 episodes. Yeah. We should probably talk about that too. 30 episodes? About? Yeah. For the book? The thing? Oh. Yeah. That looks ugly. Oh, it looks awful. But you know what? It looks awful in a sexy way. No. It looks awful. Like now, here's. Oh, now I like feces. <laughs> wow. You're, she has definitely been drinking. Feces? It does. She's it the one like... that's been talking about. I have. She has poop on the mind tonight. It's the no. second time with her and feces. No, he brought no, it that up. That was actually me. That oh. was peach schnapps and feces, but that looks like feces. Look, you know it what? Does not. It does not. Unless your feces are poop. actually, it looks like a hepatitis. Your feces are poop. Is looks like it looks I'm like. Sorry, a unless your feces are liquid poop. <laughs> it looks like an alt oh, beer. Yeah. Doesn't that look like an alt? Yes. Now, <laughs> see? It looks more like a beer. Right. I don't know. The Stop thing? making my beer look like poop. The thing that this is missing? Water. Baby diaper. The thing is missing <laughs> that I would have enjoyed to have, but also 
don't have would be a, a grapefruit. Mm -hmm. You cut off a piece of you grapefruit, would enjoy to have twist a grapefruit? it, light it on fire. Mm -hmm. No, it's it's a it's a flamed grapefruit. Yeah. Yeah. Curl it, flame it, psh, put it in there. You don't even like grapefruit. It might enhance the aroma. Oh, but... yes, it does. Looks like beef bouillon. It okay. does look. It does look. Yeah. yeah, it looks like it beef definitely bouillon. has a beef bouillon look to it. It's a fireside bouillon. fling. It's got a weird smell to it. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I look away for a minute. When I look back, they're drinking mud. <laughs> it's a vinegar. Tastes like beef bouillon. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a vinegar freaking, taste out of this. I'm not joking. Ooh, it tastes like beef bouillon. That's gross. Beef That's bouillon is pretty soft. Huh? Put it in your mouth, Doug. What? You're, you're going to no. spill it? Mouth. Okay. You're not going to spill it. I, I, I wasn't even talking about spilling it. I was talking about your mouth. Care if you spill it, it's just your pants. Chocolate starfish. You get the vermouth. Yeah. Like a sweet vermouth. Tame. Hello, sweet vermouth. Mostly get that. And the the finish is you don't get a beef bouillon. I I, <laughs> I get like a little like herbal bouillon cube like flavor sure. to it. Salty. I'll give it I'll 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 give that to you. No, yeah, I don't know. It, I mean, it, it's, it's very. It's, it's the vinegar. Yeah, there's vinegar. There's in there. vinegar in there. It has vinegar in it. Yeah. Yeah. Vinegar, a little bit of. Uh, the finish has a has the grapefruit, but it's not nearly like I was afraid that the grapefruit was going to be more grapefruity, maybe like the red eddy. Wait, that's not red eddy. Deep eddy, or something where it's like we're going to review this later if you're not drunk. Um, where it's got more. <laughs> it's got a little bit of grapefruit, hints of grapefruit. Definitely has that vi vinegar. This is a savory drink. Like, I feel like that, I mean, you're the savory guy. You're the guy who usually calls it out, but doesn't that not taste like a, more of a savory? I want to drink that and eat a fucking steak. Now with I have A1 to, on it. Now I have to remember that quote so I can use it. Last time I said, now I want an egg roll. Yeah. <laughs> like, last time you this game up? A steak, now. Yeah, like, seriously. No. It's it's Worcestershire it's, sauce. It's, yeah, or? the the Worcestershire. Yeah, yeah. Is that hate? Worcestershire? I hate Worcestershire. That Worcestershire. Mm, yeah, Worcestershire. Yum, a boozy a boozy soup. N no, seriously, I think this would be really good. It would be really a good steak. with a steak. Cookout. It, it would it would be really good with like just a good piece of meat. <laughs> <laughs> I know you tried, <laughs> but it didn't. It's work. all innuendo at this point, mm -hmm. motherfucker. All right, so it would be really good with. You can't it, it, with a piece of meat, like with beef. With beef, not chicken. No. This is a beef, beef base. Bullion. Um, you may get away with like a pork, uh, but yeah. a red meat I think is the way to go. Like, it, I really just want that to be right here. <laughs> I want to, that a little A one or something on the side. Or see sure. the. the when I think of pairing <laughs> garnish meats it with bacon with with libations uh, <laughs> you're welcome you use the word uh, red wines and that cocktail nothing else like it, it's mostly just red wines I have yeah. when, when I think about you know pairing pork with something like a pulled pork sandwich or generally anything with pork yeah. it's I, I usually I, don't pulled pork sandwich I, I, and wine but I, uh, but you uh, can a, a hobby IPA, mm. like I I think that that pairs bitterness. well, and then and then chicken pairs well with like a a, a white wine, right? Right. This but is not. That, this is a red wine type of drink. That's. that's I would really love to eat a piece of meat with that. I know. I could. I could just chew on a piece of meat with this thing right here. Yeah. I mean, it, it's got that. It is. It's it's Canon. savory, but I'm kind of getting hungry thinking about it and. I know. It's kind of killing me. Question of the day, does bacon make everything better? Yes. <laughs> does bacon make everything better? Pork fat makes everything better. Right. Duck fat makes everything even better. Better, better. <laughs> better. Uh, I don't really, I'm not, I'm not like had a lot of duck fat floating around. Bacon's so much easier to get than <laughs> duck fat. I mean, I know. bacon is everywhere. Know. You can get it at McDonald's. Bacon is good. You can't get duck fat at McDonald's. You can get bacon there. I believe Alton Brown said that uh, duck fat cheaper. is liquid love. Oh, I, I've never talked to Alton Brown, but next time I do, <laughs> I'll bring that up. With You'll them. ask him about liquid I'll take love. him up on that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
It the, really is. You say you're gonna take him up on that offer? Yeah. Yeah. I don't really know what that means, but yeah. <laughs> um, the vinegar thing is kind of different. So this is interesting. Which which is why I I would like to you know eat like a steak with it. See, these guys go the opposite. Like what I think of the anti, the, I think of this is the the um, perfect puree, right? Mm-hmm. It's mm-hmm. the blended, the frozen blended purees we use. Mm-hmm. I haven't used those in a while. I'll have to do a perfect puree ep- episode soon. Um, those are opposite. They're like juicy, mm-hmm. fruity, mm-hmm. like you want to have those sit mm-hmm. next to the pool. Mm-hmm. And then after you've had that sitting next to the pool and it's like mm-hmm. time to cook some steaks, mm-hmm. then you pull this out. Right? Yeah. I yeah. think this recipe right now, if somebody was to taste this, there's there's a niche audience for this. This is not a drink. All like Brown we, lives close to Sean. Thank you, Sean. And Georgia? <laughs> Atlanta? Atlanta? Really? Yeah. Obviously. When Remember when we had our we, we did our tasting? So one of the cool things, even if you don't have a lot of foot traffic to these tastings we did, right, mm-hmm. is to get the reaction of different people in the drinking, mm-hmm. right? And we always try and do something that's a little crazy, like the, we did Bulker's Breakfast, and then we did the Pink Cadillac, right? Yep. So you have, and then we had the Vanilla Royale and a couple people things in between. People Bulker's Breakfast. Right. And we had a lot of hit for the, that was the crazy one, though. Yeah. That was the one that I was expecting people to go, oh, I don't know. But you got the maple. Yeah. So that's the that's the draw. Yeah. This no maple. It's completely different. You're going a mm-hmm. different direction, mm-hmm. and uh, I think. Would you marinate with this at all? It's got vinegar. You can marinate with this. Yeah, I guess technically you. I don't know. It may work because like beef chips, sure. It, but it's thirteen dollars for an eight ounce bottle. That's a lot of money for marinade. Well, you know, if you and it's a good have disposable income, <laughs> right? Yeah, if you're like if you're if you're doing like a very special, if I you're eighty four and you won the Powerball, or if you're doing a very specific dinner Which and you don't in price, yeah, and price is yeah. not an is not a problem. A couple bottles of this from AwesomeDrinks.com when we carry it, I think you. That's really good. This is that is the. It's Man, I better. want a steak now. I know Just it's good in a completely different way than every cocktail we've done thus far oh, this yeah. week. At least. It's yeah. actually, I, there are a handful of cocktails that come along every now and then. Hence a handful. Right. That is very unique. <laughs> Sean unique. bought the maple and the Boker's Bitter specifically for the Boker's Breakfast. <laughs> and he's made it, I'm hoping. Yeah, have you tried it, Sean? Um, this is one of those unique. We need yeah. a playlist of just like the crazy, it would be very small. Uh, of, of just really off the wall drinks that not yeah. everybody's gonna like, no. but if you try it, you'll know if you're one of those people. It's it, and there's a position for this, like we said, for, with your steak. So I yeah, think it's a, of, if you're building out a menu of, of times, and you can, it's not an on your back type thing. <laughs> okay. Position. <laughs> right. There's a position for it. Yes, if the position is near dinner, uh, not near. Not on your knees. No, no. There is no Kama Sutra position for this, except for the position of pretty freaking awesome. That's it. EverydayDrinkers.com. I'll let you know when you see a link in the description. That means we carry it. Until then, hold off because I don't want you buying anybody else that's not us. And you can also get coupe glasses today. All right, we're done. AwesomeDrinkers.com. <laughs> EverydayDrinkers.com. We're teaching how to drink. Keep, keep, keep.